today I'm going to do a confirmation makeup hair and outfit video and this is a collab video with the lovely Ida Smith here on YouTube so go check her video out afterwards. I'm going to start out by priming my face with my L'Oreal Lumi Magic Primer which is going to give a radiant glow and it's going to give me that glow and hydration for 8 hours at least. And I'm going to go for a more natural look um, which will suit all girls. Then I'm going to take my Gosh CC Cream in the colour Ivory and CC stands for colour correcting and it will leave you with an even skin tone and make your imperfection look smaller and it only has SPF 10 in it because it gives a bit of sun protection but it won't make your face look white on photos which is really important on your big day. absorbing powder which will make your face look flawless all day long however I would say bring it with you so you can do some touch-ups during the day then I'm going to conceal a bit under my eyes just to get rid of all dark circles and I'm also going to cover some redness around on my face and then I'm just going to blend it in with my buffing brush which I also use to blend in my foundation So I'm going to bronze up a bit and I'm going to use my bourgeois bronzer which I really really love. It gives a really nice natural look and it's got a bit of a, not too shimmery but a bit shimmer in it so it's going to give you a nice glow and make you look really healthy and pretty. And I'm just contouring around on my face as you can see. And now it's time to use some blush and I'm going to use my L'Oreal Le Blush in the colour Rose Santal, which is just really pretty. It's a rosy pinkish colour and it's so pretty on the cheeks. And I'm just putting it on the apples of my cheeks. And then it's time to do the brows. And I'm using my MAC Brow Duo Palette in the colour Brunette, which I always use. And I think it's really important to do your brows on your big day because it really just frames your eyes and gives a nice effect. And I just think it looks so pretty. set my brows to make them stay in the same direction all during the day. I'm going to use my Brow Drama from Maybelline in the colour Medium Brown. Now it's time for my eyes and I'm going to use my MAC Paint Pot in the colour Bear Study. It's kind of like an eye primer but it also gives a bit of a champagne shimmery look to your lips which looks really really beautiful. yellow toned natural lid colour which I'm just putting all over my lids as you can see and then I'm going to put the colour teeth in my crease <laughs> I'm good at rhyming <laughs> But um, yeah, it's just going to give a really nice effect and kind of like frame your eyes even more and make your eyes stand out. Then I'm going in with the colour Snake Bite, which is this uh, brownie colour that has got a bit of a shimmer to it and I'm putting it in my outer V just to find my eyes a bit more. And then I'm just making sure to blend it nicely in so it still looks very natural. As a highlighter in my inner corners of my eyes, I'm going to use the colour Booty Call, 
which is just so, so pretty. It's a perfect highlighting colour. And I'm actually also going to put it in the middle of my eye, just to kind of like highlight my eyes as well, and also under my brow bone. Once again, make sure to blend the colours together really nicely, just to give that natural look, so it doesn't look like too much. And then I'm just taking my blending brush and then I'm using what's left on it under my eyes. To highlight my cheekbones, I'm going to use my Stila Kitten Highlighter. And this is just so pretty. It really just brightens up the look and I'm also going to use it a bit on my nose. Just to make me look glowy. And then I'm going to use my Rimmel Eyelash Curler to curl my lashes. And then use your favourite mascara. My favourite mascara is the Max Factor Clumpify Mascara. It makes my lashes look so long and so volumized and just really pretty. And I know that this mascara doesn't clump on me or smudge on me during the day, so it is just the perfect mascara for me. which just really looks pretty and looks good on camera as well and then I'm just going to blend it in one of my finger so it looks a bit more natural and then I'm going to top it off with a lip gloss this is the Summer Sweetheart from the MAC Archie's Girls collection but you can really use any lip gloss that you like and that was the makeup guys a really natural pretty looking confirmation eye makeup as you can see it is so natural but it just enhances the eyes a bit and makes them look really beautiful. As a hairstyle I'm going to go for a kind of like a bohemian um, hairstyle. So what I'm actually going to do is that I'm only going to use four bubble pens and I'm going to take a slice of my hair as you can see and then I'm going to divide it into two sections. Um, and then I'm just going to twirl them around each other, which gives a really nice look. It's not like a um, braid, it's more like a twirl, so it looks really cool and gives this really natural bohemian look. And then I'm just going to pen it back and do the same on the other side. This is such an easy hairstyle and everyone can do it, so I think it's perfect. It makes you look really pretty, very bohemian-ish and yeah, it looks really good on camera as well, so I really like it. For jewellery, I'm going to go for my favourite ring which is a ring that I got from my parents and I just love it so much and then I'm also going to go for um, my favorite necklace which is this heart necklace and I got it from my parents as well
someone some inspiration for your big day, please make sure to like and subscribe and also check out Edith Smith's video. Um, it's just amazing and it's a bit more of a glamour uh, look. So please go check her out and yeah, thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. Bye!